What we didn't know that we would get from Steph was a two healthy legs right after the way game three ended and then 43 points. What stood out to you about how effective he was in this 43 point performance? Well, Randy, this was Steph's flu game. This was a legacy wow. game. This is the game that's probably his best finals game of all time. It will go down in the books. If the Golden State Warriors move on to win this series, and Steph, of course, wins his first NBA Finals MVP, everyone will talk about game four, where he put on a heroic performance off of an injured angle, ankle, and more importantly, the way that he closed the game. It wasn't always his scoring. It was his playmaking as well. But 43 points, and we talked about it puts him in the category with Michael Jordan, with LeBron, as the only players to ever get this done in a final. Steph also had double-figure rebounds. When you think about he did everything necessary for his team to get a huge win on the road and tie this series and take back home court advantage. Right now, there is no discussion about who the NBA Finals MVP is, right? In a tie series, two games apiece, 137 points in these finals for Steph Curry. That's 48 more than any other player in this series.